here last year. Obviously, this is a little bit of a different situation. You guys get to host a home game. How excited are you to be able to play in front of the fans, not just the fans who have to travel, but this time right in you know your own city? Um, I mean, it's amazing. Uh, I mean, I know we love playing on our home court, and it's definitely a huge advantage. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I know we're really excited about it. I'm excited. Um, it's a huge blessing to be able to play here, all of our uh, family, fans, everybody to come out. Um, but yeah, what Coach always says, we control our destiny. So this is awesome that we had this opportunity this year and um, looking forward to it. Obviously a different team this year, but you know, when you guys look back to last year's tournament team, what are some of the things that you saw out of you know, your fellow teammates and just out of your guys' play on the court that you're like, all right, let's make sure that we incorporate that this year as well? Um, I feel like we've just grown as players. Um, we learned a lot last year. We've learned a lot this year. Um, I think we're just more mature, uh, have a lot more experience, and I think we're just more comfortable playing in those kinds of games. So I think that will, I mean, yeah, I would just I would say that. I agree. I think our experience this year and maturity um, has grown a lot. And like she said, our end of game, like close games, we've been really good this year of just closing them out. So I think that maturity um, is going to carry us what it did it last year. Looking at, looking at just mentally, I guess, based on what you know now, how encouraging is that just from a mental standpoint, sitting here knowing that you're going to host on Saturday on Friday? Yeah, it's comforting knowing that we right here in South Bend, it's familiar. Um, you know, we have our same routines and all that, so it'll be good. Um, for us to get that going. It's been a great week of practice, so I think we're going to go in with a lot of uh, momentum. Yeah, I mean, what Maddie said, it's what we know, so obviously we'll be, we'll definitely be comfortable. We've been shooting on these rims for a while now. Um, playing in front of our fans is just, I mean, it's what we know, so I know we'll, we'll be good. Congratulations to both of you. Uh, Neil said that Olivia's status is still kind of an unknown. Are you, are you having to prepare in two manners right now, and, and how difficult has it been? It's been difficult. It's been a good week of practice. Um, I think we've just kind of been preparing for everything, uh, with or without. But yeah, like she said, it's just one day at a time. Um, but yeah, we're just approaching practice in, in at, at every angle. So we've been good. With that. I think you said it all. Yeah. What was your uh, initial reaction to the matchup and to being a three seed? Um, I mean, I know we don't really know a lot about Southern Utah, um, so I can, we can't really say much about that. Um, we were going to be excited for whoever we were going to play. Um, and being a three seed, I think we're really, really excited about that and just getting to play at home means everything to us. What did you learn in the ACC tournament that you can bring into you know, March Madness? Um, I think just our resiliency. It's a grind. It's a it's a tough um, environment to play every round that we get to. So from the ACC tournament, just locking in in every situation and knowing that we have to be ready at all times um, for whatever opponent. In terms of team bonding and you know celebrating your season, what do nights like this, parties like this, you know, do for for team bonding and, and kind of team chemistry? I mean, it, it's great. I think it shows us how far we've come um, and how much we've accomplished. And I mean, it's, it's just really cool to see. I feel like looking back in the beginning, we didn't, I mean, we didn't know what was going to happen, and we've worked really, really hard all year. So just, I mean, settings like this, parties like this, it's, it's, it's just nice because we see how far we've come and we've worked hard for it. In the ACC tournament, when Liv didn't play, what did you kind of learn about your game and kind of changing roles if you were bringing the ball up more than usual? And if that's the case in these tournament games, how comfortable are you doing all of that again? Yeah, um, I mean, it's definitely a big adjustment. I think that my teammates, my coaches, um, like Maddie said, we've been preparing for everything, but they've just, they really, they've really helped me. Um, and I think that I've learned that I just have to be confident in, I mean, whatever I do. Uh, yeah, just, just play with confidence, uh, just play my game.